two, one, crescendo. And it's the Italian period in qualification match number 10 here on Consumers Field. See two notes going up for blue, make it three. All three up. Red robots are moving. 41-30, that's the tw Blue Devils. Shoot and score for Red as we move into the tele-operated period. These alliances are tied. 36 points apiece. 83-73, the Octopi machine has a note. Let's see if they can get it in the amplifier, and they do. Meanwhile, on the Blue Alliance, 302, that's the Dragons. Have scored a note, they move over to the blue source, and they're over to the blue speaker already, and they score into that amplified blue speaker. 35-38, the Robo Jackets trying to transfer some notes over for their alliance partners so they can continue to score for blue as the dread, the Dexter machine. The Dreadnoughts throw another note into the amplifier, and they're in a bit of a scrum over here in front of our head referee. The Dreadbots have another note in their possession as they move to their side of the field to score. We've got about a minute left. The blue speaker is amplified, so that means it's more points when these robots score. And 85-17 on the blue alliance, it's the Bounty Hunters shot a note out of the playing area as they are back over to the red source to grab another note to do some more scoring for red. Blues up 70, make it a, a lead change of reds up by one, 71 to make it 73 to 71. Both of these alliances have scored enough points so they're gonna take home a ranking point no matter who wins this one. And we are now in the end game period. We've got two blue robots up on the same chain. That's a harmony. Meanwhile, on the blue alliance, we've got one. That's the dragon machine in the air. And the robo jackets are in the air as well for blue. All three red robots are off the carpet and we'll see the final score here shortly. 82 to 84. Red Alliance taking home four ranking points and Blue taking home one.